Hey everyone, Matt here from Vaporev. In today's EDU, I'm going to be discussing the ingredients found in e-liquid. This is an important topic because all e-cigarettes, regardless of which kind, require e-liquid to produce the vapor we all desire. So let's get to the recipe. The mouthwatering resemblance to delicious crisp apples, sun-ripened bananas, and a wide variety of other flavors are created using the extracts, sweeteners, and food-grade flavorings. The extracts, sweeteners, and food-grade flavorings found in e-liquids are common ingredients found in culinary items we consume on a daily basis, such as yogurts, soft drinks, and desserts. The juice makers set out with a goal of developing a flavor that mimics familiar tastes, such as tobacco, or they may create a new combination, such as watermelon mint. The flavorful combinations become just one of the primary components found in e-liquid, and that component is then blended with propylene glycol and vegetable glycerin. Also referred to as PG or VG, these components can be mixed together in different ratios or used individually. The appropriate ratios of these components are based on the flavor and determined individually by each of the creators. PG and VG have different characteristics, but each act as a carrier for both the flavorings and the nicotine. Just like the food grade flavorings and sweeteners, both propylene glycol and vegetable glycerin are also found in many items we consume regularly, including soft drinks, coffee, cake mix, candy, beer, salad dressing, over-the-counter medicines, and many more. Now that I've discussed the mixture of PG and VG, I'm going to talk about the third and final component of e-liquid, which is the nicotine. The nicotine extract found in e-liquid is often derived from tobacco, but can also be found in everyday items such as eggplants, tomatoes, and bell peppers. E-liquids are available for purchase in a variety of different strengths, each containing different amounts of nicotine. Here at Vaporev, we offer our guests e-liquids without nicotine, and also with nicotine concentrations as high as 24 milligrams. This allows each person to choose an appropriate nicotine strength based on his or her needs. All right, everyone, that's a wrap on this week's EDU. I hope you found all the information useful. We'll see you next time. And if you want to check out any of the e-liquids we have available for purchase, you can find them at shop.vaporev.com.